Everybody would buy a plane ticket and end up in California. They are there in my house. I'm not saying we should all buy a plane ticket and go to Afghanistan, but we can all be contributors to a global human rights. One of you, it's just like here. But if you want to use ticket machines, pay toll booths, because the toll roads in France aren't manned anymore. Or you might want to buy a train ticket from a ticket machine. Or gas after hours. Good luck unless you... Travelers know there are alternatives to getting a ticket right there. You can get one of those museum passes for stealing and not using the ticket system if you don't ka-chunk it first, right? I love that sound, ka-chunk. If you've been to Italy, you know that sound. You've got to ka-chunk your ticket, and then it says it's used. Affairs. So there's not a, a standard curve for a certain ticket? Like, I read somewhere that like 52... Close to 50% of every ticket buyer. So we started this company in January of last year to provide access to capital. Winter, you get one ticket, you can go everywhere. In the summer, it's full of hikers, and all the gondolas are still working. And there's these kind of lottery rollovers. Buying a single ticket is only worth it if you're a billionaire. Basically. Uh, he's sick, and I have to. Could I please have your ticket? I don't know what. Whatever it takes. Well, Einstein's limit, where he'll come give you a ticket if you violate it. This is a law of nature. You simply. So he introduced fines, lateness fines. They were roughly the equivalent of a parking ticket. And guess what happened when parents... ...synagogues, and they're all linked together on one ticket. Each of the synagogue buildings has an interesting, very well-described museum. You get a, a, a traffic ticket, mm -hmm. and the traffic ticket...